and welcome to the channel. Well, to, uh, just a very, very, very quick one, ladies and gentlemen, uh, because in between this one and the one I'm actually going to do after this, which is uh, building a want to build a system on the test bed, which is up, which is up there, um, uh, which I'll, I'll link uh, in, in the video description, so you can there. Uh, so you can have a look at that if you want to, but it's uh, it's amongst my videos if you want to go and have a look at that, how I built that from scratch. Uh, see? Uh, today, I've got a quick unboxing of the uh, Cooler Master Master Watt Light 500 pound supply. Uh, I bought this for the test bench because what I'm doing with the test bench is I'm just going to put a, um, an i5 4 uh, in uh, with the 960 GTX graphics card. Um, basically, this one is for the wife. So, because she likes to play The Sims, uh, but her laptop's just not cutting it anymore. So I thought I'll build her a nice little test bench, and the whole family can sit in the games room and play games all together. Although I'm not looking forward to the electricity bill, but you know, it'll be cozy. So anyway, uh, I bought this because this uh, I only need about 350 watts, uh, and I thought this one would be absolutely perfect. Just absolutely perfect. Um, I paid uh, 35 pounds for this. Um, I actually bought it from a shop and didn't get it online, which is uh, support your local shops if you can. Um, I'm sure a lot of them are more than willing to help you uh, get to a price that you're happy with, you know? Um, but uh, definitely support your local shops. Alright, so here we go the Cooler Master Master Watt Light 500 uh, Watt ERP server. This is 80 plus certified, it's not bronze, it's not silver, it's not platinum or anything like that. Uh, I wasn't, I'm not too worried about that, you know, people say, oh, well, your power supply is going to blow up. Well, if companies made power supplies uh, that blew up and decided that they would just put an 80 plus on uh, because they blew up, uh, well, I think I might be in trouble, you know, and I'm sure with these power supplies are tested, don't get me wrong, there's some really cheap, horrible supplies out there, which I wouldn't touch. But this is a cooler master, so I expect its build quality, etc., to be quite decent. So anyway, uh, we've got a, a little manual there, this little manual, and our uh, power supply. Well, our power cable, should I say, uh, with a little bit of cardboard and a nice big bag around everything, which is nice. So we'll take this out. We'll get rid of that box, unless you want to know what's on the reels. Excuse me. Oh, that's all screws. Um, so, if we find out, we find out. Right, right, here we go. So, uh, our, uh, our 5 volt rail is 20 amps, and our 12 volt plus 12 volt rail is 38 amps, and it's rated for 500 watts. 12 volt rail will run at 456 watts. Uh, which is quite enough because we only need 75 watts for the graphics card, uh, and a TDP of 84 watts on the processor, uh, and the other bits and pieces that I have in the system. So, I'm not, you know. I've done a little test on it, yeah, and it, it runs quite well. So anyway, these are sort of braided, see-through braid. I do think that these companies, if they're going to put a braid on, don't make it see-through. Put a nice, thick, decent braid on, um, to hide all the, the, the mustard, you know? But this is what you get with a cheap power supply. Uh, what they call ketchup and mustard, isn't it? So yeah, I think we've got, uh, there's the four plus four, four pin, there's our starter connectors, our uh, six plus two, six plus two, um, and our Molex. And I still, they still put, probably, they shouldn't incorporate this little floppy drive connector you know, into something else, like, um, I don't know, RGB controllers or something like that. I don't know if they might do, but I haven't got one. 24 plus four, our 24 pin, and some more starter connectors. So there's enough on this to do what I need to do. Um, unfortunately, I'm pleased this is not sitting on the side of a nice case because that's a bit bland, isn't it? That really was a little bit bland. But that's when you get it. it's cheap, it's cheap. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here, yeah. the, the Cooler Master, Master Watt Light 500 Watt Power Supply. Non-modular, cheap, cheerful. Uh, if it blows up in the meantime, I will let you know. But well, you'll be seeing this in the next video, which will be the build in the test bench. So, um, hopefully that's of some use to you. You know, uh, I just thought it seems like getting this, might as well unbox it for five years in there, for years to have a look at it. So anyway, hopefully you enjoyed it ladies and gentlemen. If you did, you did. If you didn't, you didn't. Please tick subscribe and like, and tell your friends about the channel, so we can grow it and get it a bit bigger. Because at the minute, I just love making videos. Take care, and I'll see you all later. Thank you.